I'm Tim McGuire with an AP News Minute. President Biden travels to Florida tomorrow for a firsthand look at the destruction caused by Hurricane Ian and the recovery effort from the storm. In this from WFTS, Lee County Sheriff Carmine Marcino says dozens of people have died in his county. I wish there wasn't one casualty, okay, but the reality is we're at 55. That number can go up. Overall, 79 people are known dead, 71 in Florida, 5 in North Carolina, 3 in Cuba. Some 430,000 homes and businesses are still without power in Florida, down substantially from the post-storm high of 2.6 million. Elon Musk drops his legal battle and agrees to buy Twitter at his original $44 billion bid. Offer comes just two weeks before Twitter's lawsuit, seeking to force Musk to go through with the deal, goes to trial. Another good day on Wall Street. S&P adding more than 3%, a 112-point gain. The Dow jumped 825. The Nasdaq tacked on 352. I'm Tim McGuire.